probably wait till he comes in before I start. channel we are the moody family and we post videos monday through thursday if you would like to be a part of our fam then go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any other videos from us this is kind of our first valentine's day video um it is the first of the month when i'm filming this and it will probably go up the second of the month but valentine's day is almost here love is in the air and so i thought that i would do a cute little countdown that i saw on pinterest to bring in, I almost said bring in the new year, bring in the year slash month of Valentine. Now a lot of people can be against Valentine's Day because they say, oh well I don't need a special day to tell me to love people, blah blah blah, but sometimes it's nice to have a special dedicated time to kind of be appreciative and ow, to be appreciative and to show your love and express your love to those around you. So I thought that a advent calendar would be a super fun thing to do for my family. The things you'll need for this advent calendar are envelopes, paper or note cards, markers, pens, glitter, things of that sort, some scissors, glue, and any other embellishments that you would like. The first step is to fold envelopes in half. This is going to help you to make sure that the little pockets are even and the exact same size if that's what you want. Next year I might do a little wonky one where there are different sizes and different heights and things like that, but this year I kind of just did them all the same so I folded the envelopes in half. The next thing you're going to do, obviously, is cut them in half. Next you're going to want to glue down the flaps that are hanging out. I would recommend using glue and not licking them because it will make the front side a little bit wet if you just kind of lick them. Next you're going to want to measure the cards and decide how you want them to fit within the pocket. I made sure that mine were hanging out a little bit because I wanted them to say the day of the week on them. If you would like them to be inside of the pocket then go ahead and measure that out as well. And then you're also going to want to write out your list of activities that are going to go on the paper so that you can have them ready and set to go inside of the little envelopes. The last thing you're going to do is decorate the front of the envelopes. This is the fun part. I recommend counting down. So starting at 14 and going all the way down to one and or zero, depending on how you would like your calendar to go or 13 to zero. video i hope that you all enjoyed this cute little diy if you haven't already go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you would like to be a part of the fam and i think that's it